What's going on guys? This is the Red Rogue, and today I have something very important to talk about. Something that plagues the existence of nearly every single denizen of Azeroth. A truly lethal, unseen foe. Misaligned UI elements, and cluttered add-on icons surrounding your map like a string of Mardi Gras beads worn six months after the fact. Well, I have just the thing to help you. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode of Awesome Add-ons. While I might have exaggerated the seriousness of the situation a little bit, there really isn't much that bugs me more than my UI not being relatively symmetrical, or accidentally clicking on one of a dozen different icons surrounding on my map when I just wanted to toggle on trivial quests or something. So today's episode of Awesome Add-ons is about E-Align and Hiding Bar. I'm pretty sure there's a charming member of the Sheba Squad somewhere in the comments who mentioned the first one, and after having used it since the first UI episode I did for awesome add-ons, I can really see how absurdly useful this simple add-on can be. Basically, it puts a grid overlay on your screen, allowing you to move each piece of your user interface into the exact sections and distances away from each other that you want them to be. I'll be leaving links in the description to both of these add-ons, by the way, in case you want to try these for yourself, which I highly recommend as they're both fantastic. Anyways, to use eAlign, you simply type in forward slash align in your chat box, and wham, you have a nice grid that will show you exactly where everything in your UI is sitting relatively on screen. For someone making their own custom UI and wanting it as organized as possible, this was a lifesaver. I thankfully have pretty good spatial awareness, but even my own UI was often more sections than I realized. Thanks to eAlign though, that is no longer the case. Now I just need a new chat interface so I can hide my chat and all the funny tabs on it to make it match the size of my damage and healing meters and I'll be pretty content. If anybody has any suggestions, feel free to leave them in the comments because I am definitely interested. Seriously though, a big thank you to Lokin143 for making this add-on and for being a super charming member of the Shiva Squad. You see, self-plugs are totally legit and effective means of spreading word of mouth about your business. As a heads up, I did try testing this on the beta just to see if it would work, and unfortunately it doesn't even show up as an add-on in the interface tab. Not sure if there's any other information I can give you to help as far as getting it ready for Shadowlands, but hit me up sometime if there is. Our other add-on for this episode is actually one I just found out about a couple days ago while digging for a new chat interface. This one is called Hiding Bar, and it will basically take any of your add-ons that have an interactable button on your minimap and place them in this nice little bar that pops out of the side of your screen when you move your mouse over it. This way, you still have quick and direct access to your add-on buttons without needing a full UI suite to change things. That, and it just clears up all the stupid icons that clutter my minimap, which always drives me insane. I know I can just turn off most of them, but it's not that I don't want the ability to click on them, I just want them to be somewhere else. By using Hiding Bar, I can still retain access to things like Voodoo, Weak Auras, DBM, Tell Me When, and all sorts of other goodies. This add-on is very new from what I can tell, like the first version on CurseForge was only from March 24th of this year, but the developer has already put out a ton of updates, so I wanted to let you all know about this if you've had the same anger at the clutter of buttons as I have. I don't know how to pronounce their username on CurseForge, but it's S-F-M-I-C-T, so... Smicked, I guess? Check this one out sometime if you're looking to cut down on screen clutter. It looks like they also made a cursor mod and an improved mount journal too, so those might be worth taking a peek at sometime as well. While there are some folks who want a full UI suite like LUI or LVUI, there are others of us that just like to customize things to what we feel we need or want out of our interface without having to have one all-inclusive setup. Honestly, if you're ever bored one day, Seriously, just scroll through sites like CurseForge or WoW Interface or even just the Twitch app while they're still hosting add-ons. You'll find things you've never even thought you needed, seriously. The hiding bar is something I literally just stumbled across and it's these little things that can add some real quality of life to your gameplay. I hope you guys liked the video and let me know in the comments below if there are any other UI add-ons that you're a fan of. I always like hearing about things that I haven't seen before and sometimes I even put together a little video about them if I end up liking it, much like today's video. Thank you all so much for watching, this is the Red Rogue, and I'll see you guys around.